So today I'm turning on the 3D printer for the first time. Um, let's see what happens. The AMS. Oh, there we go. Unleash your creativity. Start. Ooh, and it made a music. Okay. <laughs> Right, I'm going to go on the Bamboo Handy app and start fiddling about with this and see what happens. Those are flashy. Okay. Um, I have bought multiple rolls of filament. However, I now realise I've not got multiple spools. I've only got filament for the spools because these are reusable spools. So I'll need to buy another three spools which I might just buy spools which already have filament on because that's quite handy. I don't have to do anything when I first receive them. So yeah. Okay. Um, let's hit start, shall we? English, yes. Uh, others. <laughs> oh, we're not Europe anymore. Hmm. Uh, okay. Others. Well, well, should I choose others? Or should I just pretend we're Europe? Others. Uh, connect to Wi-Fi. Right. Um, I'll do that. <laughs> now it's doing the, you know, oh my gosh, oh it's shaking. <laughs> oh. Oh. It's feeding it the plastic now and it's heating up. And this is the sigil from the Mandalorian. So, and it's going to take 36 minutes. <gasps> it's printing a little spoon. <laughs> it just printed that little poop. <laughs> okay. I'm going to have to learn how to recycle those. So we're doing a little mythosaur sigil from the Mandalorian. I'll come back when it's more finished. So now it's adding the infill into the middle, which is that little grid pattern. It's almost done. It looks really cool. I was just reading up about how long I had to leave it while um, it cools down so that I can take it off. Um, I'm not sure exactly how long it should I wait to it cool down. Oh, it says 10 minutes. Okay. I think it's done now. It says 99% complete and it stopped moving. Also, only one of these flashes once you've, if you've only got one of them loaded. Oh, it's spitting out filament still. It's a little tune that it plays. It played 
<laughs> oh, printing completed. It used uh, seven grams. Uh, I want to report flaws. Well, it did have a little flaw. It so it was already done, so it wouldn't have made a difference. But it was extruding when it was down here, as I showed, and uh, it tried to scrape it off, but it didn't succeed on that. So I think any time it's doing that, you need to be present. Which means any time it changes colour, you need to be here to make sure that because if it was going to change colour and go back to printing, that that was still attached to the to the nozzle, so that would have affected the print if it was doing multicolour. But um, other than that, it did really well. I have to let it cool down now. So I just removed it from the build plate, and honestly, it's freaking cool. Yeah. Uh, there's little bits here that need sanding or something, but yeah. Uh, other than that, seems pretty sturdy too. Um, but I waited until after I had dinner to remove it from the build plate because it needs to cool down once it's done. But I'm really happy with that. Seemed pretty sturdy. So, yeah. And it's a mud horn from The Mandalorian. I think I said it wrong earlier when I was explaining to my brother what it is. But yeah. I think Mythosaur is the other thing. The, the one with the tusks. Yeah. This one is the um, mud horn, yes.